Hey guys, welcome back to another week of What's for Dinner. My name is Andrea with Food Inventory Adventures in Food. We are all about the food on our channel. We do taste tests, grocery hauls, recipes, and what's for dinner. And we are kicking off another week of What's for Dinner with some French toast. Um, as you guys know, I'm still trying to use up stuff in my freezer and pantry. And this is one of the things that I got on a grocery haul that was in my freezer that I want to use. These are the Ego Thick and Fluffy French Toast with Madagascar Vanilla Extra Thick. And here's what it looks like on the package. They recommend that you cook this in the toaster or in the microwave, and that is not my style at all. So I made mine in the skillet with butter like I would a traditional French toast. So here it is. And it says thick, but really, it's not that much thicker than a regular um, slice of white bread. Um, but it does smell really good. You can see all that browning, that, how it browned up pretty good. So um, I cooked mine in butter in the skillet and then I added a little extra butter on top and then I'm topping it with some maple syrup from um, Costco and it was in the fridge and so I just heated a little bit up in a separate little glass container because I like my maple syrup warm. I'm not a big fan of table syrup at all like log cabin or this is Butterworth's. Once you try maple syrup, like real maple syrup, it's really hard to go back. And then um, on the side, we are just having some good old scrambled eggs with cheese. So this is it. This is what we're having for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, so we had to make a quick stop at Costco and decided to grab dinner there. So this is Howard's slice of pizza. He got the everything or supreme pizza and here's his slice. And then I got a slice of um, just plain old pepperoni. And then Howard wanted to try the, I think it's called a chicken roll. And it's pretty big and it's very heavy. And I think there's just chicken and cheese in there. So this is what we're having for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, I made a quick meal from the pantry. Still trying to use up what we've got. And here are some black beans. These are just canned black beans that I doctored up. And then we had some jasmine rice. And then of course, good old Jiffy cornbread on the side. Quick and easy meal. And so this is my plate. And then this is Howard's plate. He's having the same thing except he is having brown rice, which I am not a big fan of. So he's having the brown rice. I am having the white rice. And this is what's for dinner tonight. And we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, so let me show you what I'm having for dinner tonight. I'm actually out to dinner with a friend and we are trying a new restaurant, Angel Chicken Kitchen. And they have bowls and they have sandwiches and um, chicken biscuits. So this is her dinner, and it is a, what do you have again? Uh, teriyaki bowl. Oh yeah, teriyaki bowl, and she got quinoa underneath there, and it comes with the side of, there's her quinoa right there, and it comes with the side of vegetables. And then I got the, I think it's this sweet um, chili chicken, and there's some crispy crunchy chicken with some sauce, and then I got white rice. It's at the bottom of the bowl, you can't see it, and then you get the mixed vegetables. So this is what I'm having for dinner tonight. Howard's at home and he is having some leftovers, and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, we are using up some more stuff from our freezer. Howard um, made dinner for us tonight, and we are having this. Fettuccine Alfredo, it's from Sprouts, which is a local grocery store around here, like a kind of a, a healthy kind of um, organic grocery store. And um, so he made this Fettuccine Alfredo. We both tried it. He said it was just okay. He felt like it tasted a little grainy. I like it. Um, and it says white pepper, creamy, cheesy sauce, ready in seven minutes, and it's a little skillet meal. And then, um, so here it is on the plate right here. And then we are having, let me show you, um, these New York soft pull apart garlic um, knots. Here it is. And so it comes with two loaves and the loaves are kind of small. Here's what the loaf looks like. It comes with two. So of course we made one. So you can cook it in the microwave in this bag or you can take it out of the bag 
um, for a crispier loaf. And you can take it out of the bag and bake it or keep it in the bag and bake it or cook it in the microwave. Howard took it out of the bag and cooked it in the oven. And so as you can see, we've already pulled apart the little um, pieces of bread. So we haven't tried it yet, but we're excited to try it. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time.